books that I've read so far this year, 2023. There have been a couple more, I just don't have them because they were library books, but these are the ones that I own. So I'm gonna rate these books for you guys. And I also, I will recommend all of them to you, um, but I'm gonna give them a rating. So Michelle Obama's second book, The Light We Carry. I read this one in January and let's just say I recommend it 10 out of 10. Very, very inspiring and motivating. I Know Why the Cage Bird Sings by Maya Angelou. I would give this a nine out of 10, only because this is my first time actually getting through with Maya Angelou, Maya Angelou's books. Um, I feel like I'm finally mature enough to like fully understand it and understand the, the way she articulates her words and uses her vocabulary, so. Nine out of 10. Colleen Hoover's November 9th. Now, I would give this book, I would give it a 10 out of 10, but I'm gonna give it an eight out of 10, only because Colleen Hoover's, um, I don't know, it's so, like, simple. Her her word usage and things like that, it's a, it's an easy read, I will say. If you want something that you don't really have to think about, I recommend it. Eight out of 10. The Wife Before by Shinora Williams. Now, I'm gonna give this book a nine out of 10. It was a really good thriller, let's just say that. The Invention of Wings by Sue Monk Kidd. This book right here, 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10, y'all. Highly recommend, and it was part of Oprah's book club, so. The Housemaid by Frida McFadden. Another good thriller, I would give it a 10 out of 10 because I was not expecting it, expecting the ending, and this book kept me on the edge of my seat. Like, it was a really good read. I think I read it in like three days. That's how good it was. And The Housemaid Secret by Frida McFadden, the second book of the Housemaid series. I would give this one a 9 out of 10 because, again, I wasn't expecting it, but at the same time, I felt like I knew what was about to happen, if that makes sense. So, yeah, 9 out of 10 for that one. Hello Beautiful by Ann Napolitano. I always forget how to say her last name. But anyway, this was another one of Oprah's book club books and I will give this one an 11 out of 10. It was so good. I almost want to read it again. I probably will later this year, but 10 out of 10, y'all. 10 out of 10. 